Hello, I'm David Grubb with Shepherd's Loft Web Design Agency. Today, I want to go through a before and after of a web design that we did for a garage door service down in Jasper, Georgia. Now, in this video, I want to talk to you about uh, the call to action, the photo, the design, the usability, the story, and the SEO. And then I'm going to show you what the website looked like before and what the website looked after and then also what the customer had to say. So let's get started. So here's some screenshots I took of the website for super service doors, uh, garage doors, uh, before we started designing and building the website. And uh, I didn't use my tool this time, so the screenshots are a little spread out. Uh, so it doesn't quite look as good. Uh, I didn't capture the exact original design of the website, but this is pretty much, pretty much what we had to work with. So this was the original home page of the Super Service Garage Doors and this is what it mostly looked like. Now, <clears throat> they had a really good call to action. You can see at the top that they had a phone number. It was big and bold and that's a great call to action. They also had a little button at the bottom which was build a door. So the call to actions, you know, are are on point. Those were good. So there was no real problem there. The next thing is the logo and design. So they've got a great looking little logo. It's over here in the corner. And uh, so not, a, you know, again, that looks great. So good call to action, good logo. The color scheme is all in kind of a blue and white color scheme, which is good. And then the other things, uh, so here's where we things get a little bit different. So the usability, the story and the SEO. The usability is okay. You can see we have a menu in the top left over here to get to the other pages. But honestly, the, the content was quite short. This is the only content that we have on the page, and it, it doesn't really meet that 400 word minimum that Google uh, wants us to have. So the content is short, and specifically, there's no FAQs uh, or testimonials on the home page here. So this, there's a lot of components of the story that's missing. And that also really helps the search engine uh, optimization. So, so this is where the website was really kind of incomplete, if you will, uh, because the other components are here. So looking at some of the other pages, some of the same things, uh, not enough content, uh, not enough back history. Also on the About Us page, we're really kind of missing that those credentials you know there is some some information here they've been in business since February 96 uh, but no certifications really you know nothing to really elaborate on the high quality of services that they provide and then on the contact page again it's very short on content the call to action is fine the design is fine the functionality is fine on the usability side of things we're we only have content that's just in the middle of the page in here so it's it's just all clumped together could be a little bit bigger so uh, the usability is okay because there's just not a whole lot here on the build a door so this is the the best screenshot that I could get uh, but they have which and this is really good because they have a list of products here I know it's really small but these are individual products that that they resold they had the different types of doors or styles of doors at the top and then the type types of op openers and then also some different glass selections so this is all very good I got a couple other screenshots that showed these a little bit better here's a better screenshot of all the door glass uh, options that you have with the garage door that they provide and then this first picture actually has a little this was the top of that page. It has more photos that you can look at as an examples, and then it has the door style, so that's kind of the full list of the styles. So this page is actually pretty good. The problem here was that uh, the website just hadn't been updated. So the some, some of these products were no longer available, and that was a problem for them. Customers were kind of a little misled on that, and you know they had to be corrected and adjusted. So it didn't really help their sales process. So this is what the website looked like um, before we began, before we worked on it. 
So when we worked on this website, we really did focus on the things and the components that were missing. So the which was the the content, the story, the history, the accreditation, frequently asked questions, and their recommendations. So let's jump on over and look at the new design for this website and coincidentally I didn't realize this but it had been like exactly a year since the since this new website started generating leads and again I'm going to tell you about uh, the results of that at the end so here's is the new design you can see that we kept that blue and white color theme we were missing a little piece of the component on the logo so we just had to just do a very small touch up because before it was reversed out, it was white on blue. So we just had to revert, we reversed those colors because we wanted a very uh, white oriented, a very, very clean design on that. So we reversed that logo, we, we stuck with the blues. We added kind of a little champagne color button up here at the top, it's just very subtle. So we kept the call to actions pretty much. We, you know, it's build a garage door or call. So the call to actions were the same. <clears throat> we added some other elements in. So we got a new design photo for the header part up here. We added some more pieces of the story, you know, garage door installations and garage door repairs. So immediately you know exactly what kind of uh, services they offer. We came up with a little tagline for them, elegant, functional garage doors. And that kind of also helped us pull together the theme and you can see that we used a modern font that was uh, just a little bit elegant but it was modern so that helped to update the look and feel of the website so everything's kind of moving in this uh, white and blue elegant type design and layout look and feel and so that was all very good so moving on down the page we added a lot more to the story you know it's making your home look great with garage doors uh, and we added more information here and more photos uh, replacing your garage doors so there's more information about that another call to action and then on down the page uh, this is kind of the history at super service doors you get a little bit of a before and after photo but for photos you kind of get the idea that this was very very plain looking and then after you got these beautiful dark colored doors that that are more in style with with the uh, the building itself or the home and you scroll on down some more part more uh, story and then more story here so this added a lot of content to the website which makes it more searchable most of their team 80 percent of their team is uh, female and they've been in business since 1996 we saw that that little statistic before and you know there's also some important information here so you can avoid property damage and eliminate squeaking and prevent excessive repairs and you know and be happy with the and relieved that it was easy to get your garage doors fixed so making that call to action up front uh, makes this process really easy for the homeowner uh, and then here we have a section here for some testimonials again adding more content and more story to this web design and then in this section here we brought we really consolidated those pages so we brought part of that history and about us over over here on the home page and you can see they've got over 25 years of experience uh, and they, you know, the kind of a little bit of a guarantee. They make sure every garage door is safe and functional and beautiful. And here's some photos of their technicians. And then a how to get started. You talk, you get an estimate, you make a deposit. Super easy. And again, more content. Here's some frequently asked questions that we were able to help them put together and add to the website. Really, really important is we were able to put in a little map. We made a custom map to be able to add to the website to show what areas that they service. And again, following through with the, the design, the white and the blue, everything all the way down the page is very, very clean, very consistent. Uh, so on the navigation, the about link just takes you to this part of the page. But then we moved all the photos and we created a gallery page which that was actually done after we launched the website and well, I'll talk about that in the next 
So on the garage door service page, so this is actually a, a page for the services. We got a nice big you know set of text here. Uh, they provide all your garage door services, repair, custom builds, installation, and maintenance. Uh, we've got a whole gallery here. You can click on these. They pop open. <clears throat> they even have you know the type of overlay that the door is that matches the picture. So there's a text description of the photo underneath as you can click through these through this little gallery. And then we have matching testimonials to go along with that particular style of door overlay laminated garage doors so you can really learn about what kind of garage doors there are and what overlays means and you can learn a lot of information from here before you make any decisions uh, and then this is about modern and all glass garage doors so there's some pictures there a little bit of text of a description along with a testimonial and then another little gallery here and these are steel garage doors carriage doors and you can click through those and look at those photos and it talks about the stamped steel carriage door so the description of what that is again along with a recommendation from a customer so each little section there's like I think there's four this is the fourth one commercial garage doors with a recommendation and then even traditional drop garage doors which is five different um, types of garage doors and you can read and understand what each type means and also see a recommendation that they've done this for a customer so a lot of great information about the garage doors that they that they can repair or install or custom build so very very valuable information for the customers to get that in so that's the kind of the gallery page or service page then the um, and then the call to action to build a garage door this was something that so we took what was there before with the different overlays and styles if we look back to the old website you can see that there there's these door styles and these little icons so we took kind of that same idea and built it into this form when you click on traditional you get options for both glass and overlay design and then you can just click on the one that you want. It highlights in a little gray box around the icon. And, you know, so that helps you make to see what decisions you've made. If you choose carriage, you only get the glass options. So there's a, a lot of logic built into this to just really kind of guide the customer through selecting a garage door. And then modern full glass, there's not any options for that or commercial. So the most of the options are around the traditional garage doors. And then as you scroll through, we have some additional questions that will help speed up the process for the customer. How many garage doors do they do they need? And also, you know, the height and width of those doors. They can even upload a picture of their current garage door. So if it's a repair job, they can see what the damage is specifically. And then it just asks for the basic information and then whether it's a new or replace an existing door. The usability, the call to action, the photo and the design was kind of there before, but it was just kind of incomplete. And we had the opportunity to come in and help finish writing that story and building out this for the customer. So now, as I promised, we're going to look at the testimonial. So this is what Kay had to say. She said, wow, these guys are great. They took care of everything and made the process super easy. As soon as my site was launched, I started getting new, bu new business immediately. And we were so thankful for Kay for working with us. She was so on point in with she knew exactly what her customers needed and wanted. Uh, she's been doing this business for a long time, and she was really, really easy to work with, which made, which made the process have great results. Uh, so I went through and added up uh, the leads. So the website is generating about two qualified leads per month. So you saw this qualification form here. People will fill these things out. Um, it's not always about just making it easy. You also want to make sure you're getting enough information from the customer so that you can provide them with a quality quote, an estimate for the job. 
So this was a big success for both us and the customer and also Kay's customers. So thank you very much for watching. Uh, this is Shepherd's Loft Web Design Agency. Thank you. We were out to find websites on the brink of technology failure and turn them into something awesome.